I remember a childhood game called MASH. Oh, MASH yeah. stands for Mansion, Apartment, Shack, or House. Apparently, I grew up under a rock. <laughs> a brand new movie on Comedy Central called Cursed Friends takes on a whole new meaning in relation to that game. I know. It predicted your future. Hmm. This is where you were going to live, what hmm. kind of car you were going to drive, how many children you would have. Didn't, didn't do that one. So, well, we'll, we'll play it. Maybe as that's the why story I lacked airs. direction. <laughs> I didn't play the game. You didn't play MASH. I had a chance to talk with actors Jessica Lowe and Andrew Lewis Caldwell about the hilarious take. What if one day you woke up and the outcome of your MASH game was now your real life. You guys, look what I found! Oh my god, yeah. MASH, I remember, we used to play that! <laughs> uh, the film is called Cursed Friends and it revolves around that childhood game called MASH. Actress Jessica Lowe joining us. Jessica, for people who've never played the game, what is it? MASH was a future predicting game that everyone played in the 90s um, where you can predict your job, your spouse, number of kids, how you die, where you're going to live, that type of thing. And this movie is a hilarious take on what if those predictions actually came true 20 years later. There's a smudge. What do you mean a smudge? How the f am I going to die? So, Andrew, I don't remember the how are you going to die part of the MASH game. So, <laughs> but that's how this, uh, this cast of characters played that game. So what happens to your character? There are some pretty dark kids. You know, these kids, <laughs> our characters as children were pretty dark. Um, so unfortunately, um, when we're playing the game, my death was smudged. And so as an adult, I don't remember how I died. So throughout the whole movie, Josh sort of has this lingering sense of impending doom, wondering what is it that's going to kill him. He will have to wait and see. Now, Jessica, your character ends up with a whole lot of kids. Mary Jeremy Fishbane. Ew. Ugh, and I have a hundred kids. No. Oh my. My, my character is predicted to have a hundred kids. So that is reasonably terrifying, especially in this economy. That's. Those, that's a lot of mouths to feed. Oh, my word. I am married to Joey Fatone. Daddy like. Whenever I played MASH, we always picked one childhood celebrity crush to be a potential spouse. So, Jessica, when you were a teenager, who was your childhood celebrity crush? I mean, Justin Timberlake. Mm. Or Jonathan Taylor Thomas from Home Improvement. Yeah, Jonathan Taylor Thomas is mine as well. I love a center part bowl cut. Still do. All right, besides Jonathan Taylor Thomas, Andrew, who was yours? Uh, Whoopi Goldberg would have been mine growing up. Um, the big Sister Act fan. I just, Sister Act 2 specifically is the one I like the most. So I would say probably Whoopi Goldberg would have been my top. Okay, okay. Well, I, I don't think in this movie you end up with Whoopi Goldberg, but we no. could be wrong. A lot of surprises. And you never know. I mean, there are a lot of comedians in this movie. It's like Horror Film 101. Just burn it. Burn it. First Friends. A new Comedy Central original movie. Come in Saturday, October 8th today on Comedy Central. Okay, it looks funny and it could be educational for me. You, you could learn how to play, I finally. Play yes. I just played it the other night and I married Justin Bieber and we're living <laughs> in a shack but driving a Tesla. I don't want to jinx myself, so I'm all good. I'm going to avoid <laughs> that, I think. Of course, friends, as you just heard, is on Comedy Central tomorrow night at 8.